This is called a professional video. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, hey guys, me and Michaela, and I'm with my same guest. Me. <laughs> my sister, Madison. And <clears throat> we just did a video, so I'll post it and then go check it out. Go check it out. Because it'll be posted by this one. I don't. Can we start over? <laughs> yeah. Bloopers. Okay. <laughs> you almost done now. No, I can't get it done. <laughs> it's stuck. <laughs> I hate you. Mm -hmm. Amaja, you make the best one. And we're back. <clears throat> so, we... Oh! <laughs> okay. <laughs> we have a story time for you today. Um, about... We have a lot. I don't yeah, know. we have a lot of stories, like... Okay. We're gonna do... Which one you wanna do? The time where I called the police. Okay. She'll oh. tell this story. Okay, yeah. Okay, so this is my story. Um... So, this was, like, a super long time ago, like... She was, like, two or three or something? No, I was, like, six. Yeah, I'd say I was about six. I was in kindergarten. So... What did you eat? Nobody's good. <laughs> Hey, Mom. Oh, soup. It's stinks. I do. Okay, so... Um... My parents... Okay, so... Let me remind you. Like, kindergartners... And, like small kids they don't have any sense of time like they don't know time so like an hour feels like five days 20 minutes feels like three hours like stuff like that so um <laughs> so my parents had laid me my sister and my baby brother who was like a couple months old at the time down for a nap and they were going to clean out the pool so we could wake up later and just get in the pool. Because we had a pool in our backyard. This is when we lived in Florida. Um, <clears throat> and I, like, I don't even know if I, like, completely went to sleep. But, like, but, like, um... I, I guess I woke up and I couldn't find them because I didn't know they were cleaning out the pool. Like, they didn't tell us their plans. Like, <laughs> so how old were how old were you? I don't even care. I was, oh, obviously I was three, Madison. No, you're like four. Oh yeah. Well, so she was four. I was six, sure. and my baby brother was like tiny. Um, a year old probably. No. Who cares? Um. And I could not find them anywhere. Like, I'm not going to say I looked everywhere because I don't remember, like, the details. Like, I looked under the cabinets and stuff. Like, yeah. So, um, <laughs> I called the police because, hey, why not? Um, and I woke everybody up. I woke her up and I, like, got my baby brother out of his crib and... I was like, I was panicking, I guess. And the police come, and my grandma and her boyfriend were living with us. And so, like, he was, the officer was, like, going all through our house, like, looking at everything. I guess to see if we had any dangerous substances in our house that the children could get into. And all of a sudden, my parents come into the house from the backyard. So then they have to explain to the police that oh, we didn't leave them alone. We were in our backyard. I mean, I got in trouble and we didn't go in the pool that day. But now I can look back and laugh at it. Um, yeah. You got a whooping? No. Oh. Yeah. But like they they like took me into the garage and the police were asking me questions. So like, when's the last time you ate? And this is how you know I didn't know time. 
it was maybe I had lunch basically like before I took the nap but what I told them was that I didn't eat all day I had ravioli so the police go back in the house and they're like um your daughter tells me that she, you she hasn't been fed all day and they they look at me like are you kidding me right now? like they were like they were mad obviously <laughs> um yeah because w- with my grandma you never know what she could have had in her room yeah um and like when my parents came in the officer was walking out of my grandma's room <laughs> but you know that's in the past so good times right yeah <laughs> so yeah next story is about me um, I'm going to tell you when I got into my first fight and then when I slapped my best friend. Mm. Okay. Okay. So, I was, my first fight was in the second grade. And with my sister. We would always ride the bus together. Like, the same seat. <laughs> this story. Oh, <laughs> and there was some tension. And I guess I have to say I was the instigator of all of it. But it was me, her, and then this pre k and then, like, fifth grader or something? No, fourth grader? <laughs> I don't know. Some type of grader. <clears throat> and they were sisters or, like, half-sisters or something. I don't know. I don't know their life. All I know is that the older one and her were, like, getting into a little argument. You were in second, so I was in fourth. Yeah. And then the girl, the big sister was in fifth, and then the little girl was in... Like, pre-K, kindergarten. Kindergarten. Um, so instead of them fighting about it, they made me and the little girl fight. I was like, okay. Because <laughs> to you, you were like this big old bad second grader. Oh, yeah. Beating I was, up this little kindergartner. I like, was... That was my worst year in second grade. Like, I was like, savage. <laughs> but mm-hmm. I was like, bad. I did not care. But now I'm like totally different. But Psych. I was like, okay. And like, it was basically at our bus stop where we fought. Like, the bus left. And they were like, okay, okay, y'all two go. So I put down my book bag. She put down her book bag. And she was like, two feet. <laughs> And I was over here. She was tiny. I was over here, like, double her size. I remember they were like, her and the older one, they were like, yeah, beat her up. And I, like, (laughs) it was her. Yeah, all I had to do was pull her hair. (laughs) She, like, she was just so tiny. She was so tiny. Like, she was a twig. Like, she had no meat on her. And she was, like, three feet tall. I was. No more, no less. Like,. Truth be told, for a kindergartner, that is tiny. Like a six year old, that's like, or a five year old, that's like. (laughs) But truth be told, I did beat her up. I now regret it because that was petty of me and you and everybody else. (laughs) I didn't get up, get in trouble. They did come to our house and told my mom what happened. And all she said was, she was like, you don't start a fight. Because I was in the second grade. And I had some peer pressure on me by some people. Shut up. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Um, they were they were like forcing us to fight. No, but no. I didn't know good back then. Yes, I did. But um, I know better. And that was like my only time getting in a fight. Like, that was it. And I still remember it. This other time, I slapped my best friend. We were at lunch. We were at lunch. And we were playing around. What I remember, she was like, hey, do you know what Indian rug burn is? I was like, getting a burn on your knee? Like, on the carpet? I don't know. She was like, no, let me see your arm. And she twisted. Like, like she like, 
don't do it different ways like yeah she was like going that. back and forth i was like ah! and so i was like i'm gonna get you back and so i was like look at me i am the captain now so. <laughs> i was like <laughs> i was like we were facing this way and then she looked at me and i looked at her and I smacked her. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I thought I had hit her like, but she started crying. So I guess I didn't know my own strength. Then I went, and it was my left hand. I was like, I like didn't even hit her that hard. And she just started crying. And she told the janitor. <laughs> <laughs> she told the janitor, and I got sent oh to the office. God. I got sent to the office because the janitor snitched. <laughs> The janitor snitch. Oh my gosh. I got sent to the office and you put your crusty feet down. They are like, you know your mama doesn't play. I was like She was like, I'm gonna have to call my mom. And my mom came down to the office. She was like, You know I don't play that. I don't think I got a whooping. I remember driving in the car and she was like, You should have told. Why did you have to hit her back? I was like, what? <laughs> but, yeah, I kind of got away with it, I guess. I don't really know. But that's not even all our story. So, stay here. Yeah, stay tuned. And um, make sure you subscribe if you like our stories. And we'll see you guys next time. Like, comment, subscribe. Mm -hmm.